So friends, today we are going to learn about the register color code. This color coding method is applicable for the following registers as you can see that is the carbon composition register, carbon pile register, carbon film register and metal film registers only as these registers have bands on it. So this color coding method is not applicable for any other in registers except these registers. So these registers are further characterized as 4 band register, 5 band register and 6 band register. So we first take the 4 band register. So as you all can see a 4 band register has 4 bands on it and these bands let us know about the resistance value of a particular register. So let us determine the value from these bands. So these bands have been given a significant name. So let us determine the names first. The first name for the first band is the first significant digit. Thus, the second one is called as the second significant digit, the third to be the multiplier and the fourth one is the tolerance. So a four band register has two significant digits, one multiplier and one tolerance. So we now write the colors for each band. So the colors are red, brown, black and as you all can see the fourth one which is grey is not a grey but a silver one. A tolerance value for a grey color is not there but for silver one is there. So this is not a grey color but a silver color. So using register color code chart we find the value for each of the band. So the first one is red and in the first significant digit that is the first column for the value red the va for the color red the value is 2. So we write over here 2. Again for the second one which is brown that is the second significant digit in the second column the value for brown is 1 so we again write over here as 1 the third one the black band is the multiplier and in the multiplier section we find the value for the color black to be 1 so we write over here 1 and for the last one which is the tolerance in the tolerance section sorry in the tolerance section for the silver color the value is 10 so we write over here plus minus 10 percent that is the tolerance value so we have now calculated the values for each and every band now let us determine the resistance using these bands using the values for these bands so for it we have a particular pattern for writing this pattern is as shown over here here as you all can see the two significant digits are written besides each other note that the two significant digits are not to be multiplied added but they are to be written one after the other and that these two numbers that is the number obtained by writing the significant digits aside after one another it's to be multiplied with the multiplier also note the tolerance value is not to be taken into account with this uh, number and it should be, should be written aside so the values that we have found we now write that is 2, 1, 1 and 10. So we have we now see that the two significant digits have been written one after other and the multiplier is multiplied with, with this whole number and tolerance is written aside. So the value obtained is 21 ohm and plus minus 10 percent. So the value for these four banded register is 21 ohms and the tolerance rating for this is plus minus 10 percent so the four band register value can be found out using this method and now we go on to the five band register so for the five band register you all can see there are five bands on it so again as similar we have done we first assign the names for these bands so for the first band it is the first significant digit again for the second one is the second significant digit the third one is the third significant digit the fourth one is the multiplier and the sixth sorry the uh, fourth one is the multiplier and the fifth one is the tolerance so unlike in earlier case in the four band register we had two significant digits and one multiplier and one tolerance but in five band register we have three significant digits and one multiplier and the tolerance so in earlier case the fourth band was multiplier 
sorry the third band was multiplier and the fourth band was tolerance but here the third band is the third significant digit the fourth one is the multiplier and the fifth one as tolerance this is the only change considering the earlier case so again we find we write the colors for these bands so the colors are red brown black blue and silver so again using the color code chart we find the values for the for these specified colors so by similar analysis we find the values to be these so we now find the uh, value that is the resistance value for this resistance by using the pattern unlike in earlier case we have found the pattern here also there is a pattern for writing the resistance value thus the value uh, the pattern is similar to the earlier one only with one and the first and the second significant digit we add or sorry we put a third significant digit uh, after the second significant digit and the number thus obtained is multiplied with the multiplier again the tolerance value is written aside so we write the values that we have obtained that is 2 1 the multiplier value is 1m that is 10 raised to 6 and the tolerance is 10% so multiplying 2 1 0 with 1m we find the value to be 210 mega ohms and plus minus 10% is the tolerance rating so the resistance value for these five band resistor is 210 mega ohms and plus minus 10 percent is the tolerance rating so we now go on to the six band resistor so for the six band resistor we have to use the entire color code table that we have that is all the six columns of the color code chart also by using the similar analysis we we can find the resistance value only the last band that is the six band is added which is the temperature coefficient band so this band specifically tells us the temperature coefficient so neglecting this band the all the earlier bands that is the uh, first five bands are similar to the earlier case so by using the similar analysis we find the value to be 210 mega ohms and the tolerance rating is 200 2.1% so again the same colors were there so the value is 210 mega ohms and only this band is changed so the value is 0.1% so we now find the temperature coefficient value the temperature coefficient band was orange color and in the last column that is the sixth column which is temperature coefficient column the value for orange is 15 ppm so the value of temperature coefficient band is 15 ppm which is added with the rating of the resistance value along with tolerance value there is one more rating that is the temperature coefficient rating where the ppm stands for parts per million so this was all about the resistor color coding method so if you like the video you can log on to